Good morning, mountain bikers. I'm Chris Wessels, and you are watching MTB Trail Review. We are about to drop into Turtle Trail. Turtle Trail at Snow Summit is their blue trail with potential jumps, not real jumps. You can roll them, you can hit them, but lots of berms, lots of flow. It's the next step from going green, and it's definitely worth riding. What do you guys think? That was fun. Yeah. It's rad. I think you're just a little incorrect because it's afternoon, but you have to start the video with good morning because it's MTB trail review. Well, and the video is going to be released in the morning. It'll oh, be morning when I watch it. I'm always wrong every time, no matter what. I love it. Enjoy the ride. Woo! Turtle trail is really fun. And it's a great step between going green and some of the other trails that are available at Snow Summit. This is the closest thing that Snow Summit has to a true flow trail. If you ride it properly, you probably won't have to pedal. That said, there are some sections that do point uphill just a little bit, and throwing in a couple pedal strokes will help you to carry speed through them. But if you're ready for a challenge, see if you can do the entire trail without pedaling. It is definitely possible. Turtle Trail's dominating feature is big sweeping berms. It's got a lot of down, a little bit of up, and a couple opportunities to catch some air. The first one being right here. It's a little bit of a step up, but you can case it with no consequence. That said, if you are going to try to clear it, be prepared to hit the pedals. While riding Turtle Trail, you definitely want to do your best to focus on cornering, work on your body position, work on carrying speed through big berms, and then ask yourself, am I ready for one of the harder trails? If this trail is coming easy for you, then you may be ready to check out the Blue Steel, and then possibly Party Wave, and keep on going up to Miracle Mile. Now this is a good opportunity to talk about I guess trail etiquette. If something happens on the trail where you need to stop, what you don't want to do is have yourself or your bike in the middle of the trail. This could have been bad. Luckily, it was on a straightaway that was long enough where I could stop, and then I was able to move the bike. That way, anybody behind me wouldn't run over it. But if you're ever in a position where you need to stop on a trail, don't leave yourself or your bike in the middle of the trail unless yourself is so broken that you can't be moved. So, as always with the bike park, you want to pre-ride, re-ride, then free-ride, as some of these are over-jumpable if you're not careful, but you can pre-ride this pretty hard because for the most part, there's no tech, there's no gaps, there's nothing that's really super dangerous on this trail, it's just super fun. That's all I have to say about it, I'm going to let you guys enjoy the rest of the trail.
Bull crap. you enjoyed this look at Turtle Trail. If you have any questions about the trail or any questions about any other trails at Snow Summit, leave them in the comments and I will do my best to answer them. Thanks for hitting the trails with me today and I'll catch you guys on the next one.